Chandra would be uh, you could meet him for the first time. For someone who's an old time old Chandra that old hat at Chandigarh. He was coincidentally here when he and I were talking. Uh, when Thai got launched in 2000 and no, I'm not mistaken the building. This looks very much like the building I came to. It reminded me of the CII building. Oh, it was okay. also very similar. So you, it was in CII? Possibly. Fair, fair. How, how are these buildings? Yeah. Uh, the whole idea of this conversation was intended to be a no holds barred conversation. Uh, Shirdar has worn many, many, many hats. Uh, and I, I tried to enumerate some of them. Uh, currently, he is a partner with Bessemer Venture Partners. Uh, Bessemer is uh, uh, one of the largest and the oldest VC slash VC firms uh, that traces its uh, heritage what to the early 1900s. Uh, if, if you miss, uh, so they've been around for about 100 odd years. Uh, Shinder also um, is one of those unique guys who has been with KPMG as a partner in all the four geographies. Uh, in all their four practice areas. So uh, that's uh, uh, as multidisciplinary as it gets. Uh, Shiddar has been the chairman and CEO of KPMG in India. Uh, Shiddar has worn uh, where many board of directors hats, notably uh, ICICI Bank, Infosys, Murugupa Group, Career Launchers, Reader, and the list goes on and on. Uh, in Thai, he was uh, the president of Thai Silicon Valley, the president of Thai Mumbai, the president of Thai Global. Uh, so the intention of this conversation really is that there is someone who uh, has been around, who has seen a lot, uh, who has worked with a wide variety of entrepreneurs and business leaders at different stages. Uh, and, and the idea was to have a conversation and ask all sorts of questions. And on that note, I thought I'd first uh, give the mic to Shiddar for a couple of minutes uh, to set the stage and we can start the Q&A. And I'll probably ask the first question and without the second question. <laughs> so those are the two reserved questions. <laughs> <laughs> but I say, oh, why do you think of a question to ask? <laughs> <laughs> so think of another one. That's, that's all right. So Shiddar. Yeah, yeah, it's always a pleasure to come back to Chandigarh. You know, I said this must be my fifth or sixth trip since uh, you know, Chandigarh was chat by chat when we started. Uh, I, I think, you know, I, I talk now, I spend a lot of time in India and I travel you know, throughout India quite a lot. Uh, I still consider the you know, US my home, but I spend equal amount of time you know, both in India and in the US. Uh, and, the reason I keep coming back to India, apart from that, even when I'm in the US, I'm only thinking about India. So 100% of my mind is in India. Physically, I may be, you know, in, you know, in the US. And I think that is because, you know, I sense there is certain, some things which have been happening in India over the last few years, you know, which is absolutely exciting. You know, there is so much opportunity, you know, for the people uh, that, you know, you actually have choices, and sometimes having too many choices actually is bad. It's like going into a shop, and you only want two colored shirts. You know, otherwise, if you see ten, you walk away not buying. You know, in India, there is a sense of there are so many opportunities that people are most probably not taking advantage and jumping in and trying to do too much, you know, sort of soul searching of what to do and how to do it. So I think you are in a great, great position. I said I was asking. You know, this morning, it says, uh, you know, are there a lot of young people coming to Chandigarh? Are the young people in Chandigarh staying, you know, and wanting to live here rather than, you know, migrating out? Because if that is happening, then I think that the ecosystem will will grow. You know, uh, I went. He took me to a restaurant this morning, Willow uh, Cafe. You know, now. Uh, I would suggest to you that five years ago, a place like that might not have existed in uh, Chandigarh. Right? You know? you know? And so something is happening. The, 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 what the people need now is very, very different to what most probably I needed. I take advantage of it. But the world is being redefined, I see, in Silicon Valley everywhere by a totally new generation of people. You know? And that's happening in India as well. So, 
what were considered businesses at one time, you know, they are still there. There are a lot of new things which are happening, you know, the social networking, media, you know, and uh, and its physical manifestations like a Willow Cafe or a Barishka and all of these have occurred, would not have occurred in a previous generation. No. So there is a tremendous change which is going on. It's very, very exciting, very, very exciting. You know, uh, and opportunities in all areas, you know. Uh, and if somebody asked me what Bessemer is focused on, and I said, you know, we are focused on infrastructure and we focus on power, education. Those are the three areas. We are basically sector agnostic. We invest in big companies. But those three are areas where we think there is tremendous potential. And we are looking for opportunities, you know, in each one of those spaces. But I am basically here to say, you know, talk about anything and anything you want. If you start a thread of conversation, you know, we can move. So, so let me set the stage. Uh, before I ask my first question, I thought I'd just start off with Bessemer. In terms of Bessemer, I think Bessemer has invested in two companies in this region. Uh, could you just tell a little bit of which, which are the two companies you guys have invested in? Yeah. You're going to embarrass me. Is you just you know? Okay, <laughs> no, so one. one. Okay. No, one. But the other one also, I don't know the name. No, no, no. no. <laughs> and, uh, Bhagat is Lakshmi yeah. and Venus. 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 Those were the two, right? See, I'm not involved in either. See, I'm, my role with Bessemer is very much as a mentor for what I'm doing here. So I mentor their staff. I mentor some of their portfolio companies. You know, and. Because of my other involvement in India, there are opportunities which I see that I bring as a to those people. If they want any doors open anywhere in India, they call me and say, Do you know somebody? It's invariably, I know somebody who knows somebody, you know, and uh, the appropriate you know. So that's my role. But with these two companies, at least with one, I have interacted quite well. You know, with uh, Lakshmi Energy, I've been and visited you know, them quite a few times. I've met Mr. Paul. You know, and, and you know, and I will tell you, he. Every time I eat rice, I look at it differently now after my interaction with him. I did not realize there are so many things you could do with rice. You know uh, that you know uh, how you grate them, the oil which comes from it, the husks, and all of that. And he, I remember, you know, he showed me something. Uh, and it was at the what are they called? The Dharwadi Airport. This is uh, Chambers. Chambers. So at the Chambers in Delhi, we walked into this room, and all, all along here there were little bowls. And I said, "What is all this? You know, for a presentation?" And it was every single component of rice. You know? But it's also tied to another thing. So we, see, it's only a rice mill. No? He produces only electricity. It's never and so, captain. And, I, and the other day, the last time I was at their plant was, I think, last year, last time I visited. And at that time, India's uh, uh, you know, power sector had opened up that you could sell the power. And he was actually trying to do a deal with a company which was based in Karnataka to buy the power. Because it's no longer necessary for you to sell the power to a company next door. Under the current trading system, you can say, you draw the power over there, I will sell it here. So, which again says, hey, somehow or other, we create in the physical world an interchange which is very much similar to the social networking world where geography is no longer around. You know? Yeah, as I said, both those investments I'm not involved in, you know, uh, but you know, they're long-standing investments. Yeah. Yeah. No.